Anybody open? Huh, not me. Why me? Hey, there's so much mustard on these things, I can't even read them. <laughs> you ought to see a medic about that. <laughs> Nobody can open, huh? Oh, I can't open. <laughs> well, I'm burning. Uh, uh, will the bridge players hold up the game for me? <clears throat> this is a replacement. My name is uh, Private Orville Putnam. Why don't you take, uh, take that uh, cut over there, huh? Right. Thank you. Hey, welcome to the Milling and Marching Society. Hey, uh, fresh out of basic, huh? No, sir, I transferred from the... Uh, sir! <laughs> are you kidding? <laughs> I ain't that much older than you are. Well, I don't know about that, then. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe they just taught him a little respect, Kirby. Uh, that's something you probably wouldn't understand. Well, uh, where'd you say he's transferred from, Orville? 103rd. Oh. Kirby? Uh, can Deuces open? No, Jack's a better. Well, if they're a 10th, can I open with that? Hey, uh... If you guys don't mind, uh... Nobody calls me Orville. They call me Putt. Short for Putnam. <laughs> well, I don't mind. Uh, 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 Cage, uh, any of you guys mind if we call uh, Orville Putt? It's uh, short for Putnam. Of course not. <laughs> I like that better. <laughs> what can you open? I have seen worse cards. And... Well, I haven't got much to open, I can tell you that. How about you, Kirby? Uh, can deuces open? Hey, nobody opens, huh? Yeah, mm. ten. Oh, come on, man. Well, it wakes me up. Hey, Harvey. You owe me one, remember? Come, come. Thanks, old buddy. Hey, man, it's nice having some new blood in this outfit. Listen, uh, can you loan me five bucks till next Thursday? Oh, yeah, I guess. Yeah, sure. Hey, Harvey. Why don't you get him down and put his pack down before you put the bite on it, man? No, it's all right. It's okay, really. Here. Well, what do we got here? No, oh, no, that's not a nice way to act. Come on, Orville, let's see the picture. Hey, come on, man. Let's see the picture. Come on. Now, listen, you don't want me to write and tell your mommy that you're not sharing with your buddies, do you? My mother's dead. You having fun? Oh, come on, Sarge. I didn't knock it off. He doesn't need any money. Got a rich personality. Sit down with that. Teacher, man, I promised him I'd bring him back some from where I fought. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> Must be uh, pretty interesting if you know something about it. Yeah. I know a uh, a pine from a cottonwood, and I'm afraid that's about all. <laughs> uh, look, um, oh Harvey, you're just kidding around. I mean, you, you do have a right to some privacy around here. 
Uh, you don't have to show that to anybody if you don't want to. Well, I know that. I mean, what's the difference anyway? You mean you, you really didn't care if he saw it? Well, no, why should I? It's just uh, it's a picture of me in my hometown newspaper about me joining the army, that's all. Oh. Well, uh, anyway, like I said, Harvey likes to as a kid the new replacements, you know. So don't let it worry you. Look, um, come on, I'll, sh I'll show you the ropes around here. I can huh? open. I'll open for ten. You don't have to worry about me. You don't have to uh, show me the ropes. You look like you got enough to do to take care of yourself. I manage. I was just messing around here. I was collecting leaves for that professor friend of mine. There's nothing wrong with that, is there? No, nothing wrong with that. How do you like it in the 103rd? It was all right, I guess. Well, it must have been pretty rough in those mountains around La Mode, yeah? Yeah, it's pretty rough, all right. I tell you, I was sure glad enough to get transferred out of there. You figure this would be a picnic after Limoges, huh? <laughs> you can say that again, sir. Well, I tell you, anything would be a picnic after Limoges. The 103rd never got near Limoges, and you never got near the 103rd. I didn't want the guys to think I was a green recruit. I didn't want to be laughed at. You think telling a lie is going to make you a veteran? No, sir. Don't you think those men were green ones? Are you going to tell them, sir? I told you to stop calling me sir. I'm sorry, S Sergeant. I forgot. Well, don't forget. I'm a buck sergeant, a squad leader. I'm not your Aunt Minnie and I'm not the chaplain. <laughs> Kirby, hmm? do you really think that's going to do any good? <laughs> <laughs> well, when one has natural charm, it don't much matter what one looks like, does it? <laughs> I don't know about that. <clears throat> hey, where are you guys going? <clears throat> Out. Come on, you guys, let's go, huh? Let's go. Now, uh, where? Hey, tell us something. Why do you guys keep all the women around this place, anyway? I know, kid, I've been all over town, I can't find any. <laughs> Hey, little John, come on, you must know where the action is. Where? Well, there's a little bistro down the street. Hey, it's a good idea. Hey, the first round's on me, all right? Hey, we're going to look like that in a couple hours. Give us a couple of balls, your best being ordinary. See, we play. Thank you, thank you. Here we go. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a pretty nice little flag. Oh, oh, I'm glad you like it. You better like it. It's the only one in town, you know that? Oh, uh, no, that's the other one. Hey, wait, wait, wait. The first round's on me. Oh, well, thanks, well, Harv. I, I forgot my money anyway. <laughs> Huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, that's pretty nice. For that, forget it. <laughs> no, no, why should he forget it? 
Look, I'll drink to that putt putt old buddy. Nice is what she is. <laughs> eh. Mm. Problem is, she only goes in for a big college men, though. Oh, oh, Harv, get off his back, will you? So we ain't a type, but maybe it's different with old putt here. Look at that nice clean cut face. Pretty hair. Good manners, big college man. I bet you even got away with the women. I don't know about that, Art. Why you dog you? What's with this modesty? Uh, I bet you got a whole string of women back home. Hey, Harvey, ease up on that stuff, huh? What are you trying to prove, Harvey? Come on, let's get off this cake, huh? Hey, wait a minute, what's the big deal? What makes you guys think you're so smart? I've been around, I'm not a green kid, you know. Put, now look, this here stuff might be a little stronger than you're used to. Don't let him talk you. Who pointed you, Chaplin? I know how to handle wine. I know how to handle women, too. I can run my own show. I don't need any help from you guys. Hey, eh bien. My name's Bud. You gotta dance with me. Pauvre Please. Go back to your table and behave yourself. Somebody find show you put on there, boy. Ham's a break. Join the Ah, uh, she turns you down cold, <laughs> huh? She's busy right now. Aw. Hey, listen, man. She uh told you something in French. Now, what was it? Was it a little pet name? Hey, Cage, what was it? Skip it, Army. Ah, oh, come on now. I want to know. I said skip it. Hey, come on, lover boy. What was it, huh? Hey, come on. <laughs> Tell me. What did she say? I'm finished now. Shall we go? She was surprised. How dare you behave the way you did in there? Who do you think you are to make advances to a woman you have never even met before? Uh, I'm sorry, Father. I... Sorry? Stupid, that's what you are, an idiot. If I did not have a brother about your age, I would have left you in there for the men to see how silly you really are. The reason I was talking like that around those guys was because I... Would you behave this way in front of your parents? Well, my parents are dead. I'm sorry. Oh, no, that's all right. My parents have been dead a long time. My mother died when I was born, and my dad when I was seven. Pud, how long has it been since your father died? Eight years. Seven and eight, that's 15. Just as I guess you're a child. <laughs> no, no, wait a second. You got me all mixed up. Uh, I, I mean, my dad's been dead 12 years. But you are too young to be in this war. You must tell them. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, they send me back. You gotta promise you won't tell them. No, but I am your friend. If you're my friend, you won't tell them. Please. Why did you join the army so young? Well, I don't know. I... I want to make friends, uh, buddies. Uh, you got to promise you won't tell them.
grace and charm, Kirby. <laughs> <laughs> just go all off against you. Well, look who's here. Right. Hey, Pat! Late old Casanova himself. Hey, listen, I, I want to congratulate you. You're about the first G.I. that old far better ever went out with. You know that? Because I'm just your type of stuff. Yeah, that's what I was telling you all along, isn't it? Yeah. Oh. Let's have a little game. Come on. Oh. Hey, listen, Kirby, as you want all the money today, how about Spider-Man 10? Okay, here, uh, okay, tap it twice. Wait a minute, wait a minute. No bridge. Huh? No more bridge for tonight, huh? Knock it off, hit the sack. Well, Sarge, what do you mean? We're gonna play a little poker. We're on a 48-hour pass, remember? We had a 48-hour pass. We're going on patrol first thing in the morning. We're two. What? The 46. Well, Sarge, there's cross out there. Yeah, hey, all the way out there again, Sarge. What for? Well, the tank's going against the mountains in the morning. They figured that might force the crowds to flank us. We well, get up there to spot them as soon as we can. Any more questions? I'll take it back. You won't need it. What the heck? It's just a reconnaissance patrol. <laughs> yeah, but recon patrols around Hill 46 have a habit of getting a little rough. Take five. Okay. Good. Why? Right. Hey, little John, you guys, uh, you guys been out in this area before? How do the crowds operate around here in this area? What do you mean? They operate the same as they do in any area. And we do too. You see them first, you shoot first. If they see you first, they're gonna shoot first. And they teach you that in your whole outfit? Of course they did. What do you mean? Crowds of patrol in this area just like us. Battalion's hunch is right. I might expect anything today. I hope Battalion's hunch ain't right.
Hey, mister. I think he's dead. Good. I'll let it get to you, but This is the one you have to get over. Your first dead one. What do you mean, my first dead one? Look, there's nothing to be ashamed of. There's always a first one for all of us, you know. I've seen plenty of dead Germans before. I don't think you have. I don't think you've seen action, ever. I've been watching you. I tell you, I've seen plenty of dead Germans before. I even killed a few myself. What are you trying to pull? Will you stop babying me? Look, you. I don't care how many Germans you've killed or how much action you've seen. All I want to know about a man is what I can count on him for. No one's dead. What's the trouble? No trouble. Roger, out. I just talked to Darden. The other patrol's in a lot of trouble. Second battalion's taking quite a beating up in the mountains. Casualties are pretty bad. I guess there's more crots around here than anybody figured. Those two must have been scouts. We better find the rest before they find us. Gage, Kirby, you fan up to the left. Harvey Putman to the right. Little John, take the point. Come in. Lieutenant Henley. Yes, Povet. Sergeant Sanders and his men, where are they? On patrol. Is it a dangerous patrol? All patrols are dangerous. Private Putnam, is he with that patrol? Yes, why? No reason. Thank you. down and follow me. Come on. Trying to get to some high ground so we can flank a crop machine gun without getting our heads blown off. Okay, come on. I 
Harvey, you all right? Harvey? Harvey, come on, lad. Harvey, what are we gonna do? <laughs> I don't know what to do! These two were too darn late. Hey, where's our Putnam? I sent him up to the right. I can't see nothing. All right, fair enough. Stay down. Let's find Harvey and Putnam. Let's go. This is White Rook. White Rook, check me king too. Come. Lieutenant, I must speak to you. No, no, now, Forbid, I'm busy. You must call Private Putnam back from that patrol right now. Look, Forbid, I got a thousand things to do. Private Putnam is only 15 years old. Putnam is 15? Yes. Well, that's impossible. He told me so himself. Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey, Sarge! It's Putnam's pack. Hey, Sarge. Found these down below. It's Putnam's. It looks like he might have chickened on us and run. Maybe. Won't do him much good without his rifle. How oh, are these trees full of snipers? <laughs> He's dingy. What's he doing way over there? Giving him target practice? Well, why didn't you tell me when you first found out? I did not want trouble for him. Anything? Nothing, sir. Keep trying. White Rook, this is Checkmate King 2. White Rook, this is Checkmate King 2. Come in, White Rook. It's no wonder they transferred him out of the 103rd. He wasn't transferred from anywhere. He came in green. Well, you can't get much greener than that. White Rook, this is Checkmate King 2. Checkmate King 2, Checkmate King 2, this is White Rook, over. Got him, Lieutenant. This is Checkmate King 2, over. Hey, Sarge, it's a Lieutenant. Checkmate King 2, this is White Rook, over. White Rook, we've been trying to reach you. Have you made contact, over? Affirmative. Up that a machine gun, this is the 10th Regiment. Right now we're in contact. We're pinned down by enemy snipers, over. All right, break contact as soon as you can and get back here and take care of Private Putnam, over. Take care of him, Lieutenant. Right now he's pinned down on a, on a hill about 200 yards away. We may not be able to pull him out. Over. All right, do what you can. Putnam is only 15. Repeat, 15 years old. Do you, Roger? Over. Roger. Get out there, he's only 15 years old. 15? He's bigger than I am. Well, what? How come he's got such a chip on his shoulder? If you ever had a kid, brother, you know why. Well, I knew that kid never seen a dead man before, but... Well, I don't care if he is only 15. He ought to know better than to go off and leave his rifle like that. You want me to go after him? You better stay here, I'll go. You're too big a target. Stay here, the both of you. Keep the lieutenant posted. If anything goes wrong, you wait for doctor and head for home. Cover me. As if you can see anything and shoot at. killed. He's hit. We gotta help him. No, wait, wait, wait. He's going again. Why some cover? Just anything. Fire in the trees. They gotta be in the trees. Well, there are a million trees. Just fire, fire. Sarge! Hey, 
Sarge! Oh, Sarge, you know how bad I am to see you. stupid stunts. What do you think you're going to do, scare the enemy off by making faces at him? Sarge, you didn't know... Don't give me that Sarge stuff. You know, soldier, you're nothing but a stupid 15-year-old kid. And you're going stateside as soon as the army can find transportation for you. You hear me? Gee, I'm glad to see you, Sarge. What are you doing here? Harvey said we were supposed to make it to high ground. And then what? Huh? What are you going to do, fight the enemy barehanded? I dropped my rifle. I couldn't get back to it. I tried to take care of Harvey. I didn't know he, he was dead at first. All right, now you stay close to me. You hit me right on top of me. I'm gonna try to get you out of this. All right, let's go. I can't see him. If only I could spot one of them. Sergeant, you stay here. Keep your head down. I can see every move we make. We're trapped. Sarge? You have to stay here till it's dark. Sarge, I think I know where the snipers are. I can see him. Now look, don't give me any more of your kid stories, you hear me? No, honestly, I can see him. That's what I've been trying to tell you. It's been bothering me all along. It's, it's kind of clusters of, of leaves with, in the trees with, where they don't belong. At least according to the nature, they don't belong there. There's one of them right on us. Stay back, Jack. Stay down. I'm sorry, I forgot. Okay, show me where. Well, straight out there from us. See the tree that uh, sticks up higher than the rest of them? About two-thirds of the way up that tree, there's a dark patch. You see it? It's sort of Y-shaped. That's a sniper, huh? Well, at least it's a bunch of leaves where, where they don't belong. All grouped together there. Yeah. Okay. The one on the left, about halfway up, is another dark patch. Huh? Got it. Those two you got were, were the only ones close by. All right, now you take your time now, huh? Take a good look. I'm pretty sure, Sarge. There's others farther back, but you can't see them from here. Okay. Let's go back and get them. They got the squad pinned down. I'll keep low. Let's go. Big one with the fork trunk about halfway up the left branch. Hey, down there. 
just got to get away. Big tree up, up in the top where the sun is and leaves. How'd you do it, Sarge? I must have looked at that tree 20 times. I didn't see nothing. That's the one that's been pecking at us so hard. Well, the trick is to see what you're looking at. The sniper stuck out like a sore thumb. Doing all leaf collector. You can really see them, huh, Pat? The leaves the snipers were using didn't fit in with the trees. What? Here, I got your rifle. I'll lose on you. Keep it. Keep it. We're not out of this yet. So you just keep your eyes open. We'll take care of the shoot. Okay, let's go. Lieutenant Hanley chewed you out real good, huh? Not as good as Sergeant Saunders. Well, he didn't have as much reason. <laughs> Do you wish to order? Oh, uh, yeah. Give us a couple of bottles of, uh... No, uh, make it, uh, lemonade for everybody, huh? Hey, uh, what? There's a, there's a plant by home, and I thought maybe you could tell me how to... Excuse me, just a second, please. Yeah. Fauvel? I'm sorry the Army found out about your age. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Lieutenant Henley said that a friend told her. You're not angry? right about everything? Oh. You'll be going back to America? Yes, I'm leaving tonight. I just, uh, wanted to say goodbye to you. Goodbye. Pat, I know you will grow up to be a fine man. Hey, let me take this tray for you. He's got a civilian job. <laughs> hey, uh, Pipe. There we go. Jeep's ready. Hey, his drink just got here. It's all right. I wasn't thirsty anyway. Well, I'll be coming back in two years and uh, three months. Of course, I guess you guys will probably have it over by then anyway, huh? Uh, goodbye. Take it easy, Sarge, you don't think this thing could last two more years, do you? Are you kidding, Kirby? The soldier like you around? Gotta go ten. <laughs> 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 Cheers, Kirby. Cheers, Kirby. That was good.